Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I am Miss Roxanne and this is Daily Rambles. Today we are trying to focus and we are going to be doing season 3 episode 6 a daredevil called The Devil You Know. So we start with Karen is hungover as hell and basically goes to the conversation she had last night with Foggy and Foggy says that she's still a good person and that, you know, you were doing it in self-defense and like what'd you do with the assistant where are your clothes where's the actual weapon and she basically got rid of everything <laughs> she was very thorough with that and then we then she hears someone break into her apartment we, it's matt and she's like you have any money for your rent <laughs> And basically, um, then he says, like, I need your help, and gets her dirt on Fisk, but she doesn't really want it. She's kind of over it and done with it. Then we cut to where Dex is still spazzing, and so he listens to some more tastes to give him to calm down. Then Fisk got his more privileges, so basically, he got his paintings, he's got his clothes back, he's got this, he's got that, like, it's like, to the brim of his stuff. Which is a lot of stuff. Then we cut back to um, Karen not wanting the dirt, but uh, but talks to Foggy about it and suggests to do it unless he turns himself in. She agrees to that, and we have Dexas back at work, and he's basically zoned out, which she I guess he normally doesn't do because everyone's like, "Are you okay?" He's like, "Yeah, I'm fine." So and then he goes to give the food to Fisk, but turn off the camera and talks to him. And shares the history with uh, Dex about what he did when he was younger and all that type of stuff that happened. And he isn't having it. And then we cut to where, the, where he finds out that the FBI is throwing him under the bus. So this is kind of like his tip of point, which I kind of covered in the last video. And then we cut to where Karen talks to uh, Sister Maggie. And then Matt talks um, about his childhood and then we uh maggie talks to her about his childhood and all that type of stuff like how basically um every time he cries she'll go to uh to him and help him but one time he didn't he basically shut her out and was like okay i don't need your help anymore period bye <clears throat> and we cut back to um point dexter's kind of He's like having an internal fight in his head, but he's trying to stay calm when he's talking to the FBI people about everything. Uh, about throwing him on the bus, but he's super pissed and his superior is no help. Then we cut to where Karen is trying to find the guy and so she bought some, some illegal substances to find him. And he finds him, but Daredevil followed her and he will turn himself in if the guy will testify and do the dirt on Fisk. And uh, we find out that Fisk threatens his son. Karen doesn't care and she's playing hardball. <laughs> she's like, uh-uh. You're still going to do this damn interview now. And then we cut to where Foggy meets with Nadim for questioning after he talks to Jasper Evans as to the guy that they were looking for. So that's who Karen has at the newspaper. Uh, they think it's a bluff, so they really don't want to do that until they run a check on, like, where this guy is. And then we cut to where Dex almost offed himself, then he got a call from Fisk and sent him a gift. And that gift is a person in the car taking him somewhere. And then we cut to where Matt gave Foggy a new wallet. Then we cut to where the FBI is gearing up and moving out to somewhere. And then we cut to where Karen boss um, apologizes to her. Then Matt hears screaming. Then it's, um, we found out that Dex is uh, dressed as Daredevil. So then it's Max versus um, Matt versus Dex. And then we have like a really excellent fight scene. Like they both use their hearing and like point like Dex is really good at. <laughs> Kicking his butt, basically. Like, it was a really good fight scene. Then Dex kills him. Then off Karen's boss and Evans. Then leaves. Then it's, uh, Dare... 
Dex as Daredevil versus the FBI. And no one's having it. Everyone thinks it's actually Daredevil because it's actually his suit and stuff. But um, everyone's like, you know, Daredevil did it. Daredevil did it. So I thought that was really interesting on, on that whole thing. And that was the end of the episode. So crazy episode. Really enjoyed this one. I give it an A minus. Just a couple tiny, tiny, tiny little things that I didn't like. But um, overall, I like, I mean, I, I just thought the switch, that, that was my gripe about this episode. The switch was like too quick for me. I, usually you would do like a three episode arc of him turning and not like a episode and a half, basically. So I, th I find it just really interesting how they kind of sped through that one a little bit. But other than that, it was a really good episode. The fight scenes were fantastic. And um, the fact that they off the boss, or Karen's boss and the witness, I was like, it's crazy that they let Karen go. And he goes, hey, Karen. <laughs> and like just bails, <laughs> which I thought was crazy. But anyway, really good episode. Really enjoyed it. And that's going to do it for this video. So, ladies, video, please go to like, comment down below. Tell me what you think of the episode. Do you agree? Disagree? Just tell me your thoughts down below, down there. And don't forget to subscribe because it helps out the channel a lot. And I'll see y'all in my next video. Bye, everybody.